I received a question from a subscriber, Phil, Phil, Phil. Let me show you here. Phil, Phil, Phil's question is, thanks for your reviews. I pulled the trigger on the antelope, which is this. Uh, my question is, I usually am a side sleeper, but change sides. Does the zipper impact your sleeping on it? Can that be felt if sleeping on it? I guess the baffle helps. Thank you very much for the question, Phil, Phil, Phil. I'm actually gonna lay down and show you on my Expat air mat and my sleeping bag exactly what this is like and talk about some of the issues and how I compensate for them. By the way, if you have a question, please ask it in the video in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer the question either directly or in a video. Here I am in my antelope sleeping bag on my Exped 9 air mattress. Now, I am actually a side sleeper in general, unless I'm totally wasted and then I'll fall asleep in any direction. But let me show you the technique of how I do my side sleeping and deal with it with the baffle and zipper on an air mattress that's super, super thick. And what I'm gonna do is just <clears throat> simply lay down. <clears throat> All right, and zip this thing up. Okay. Now there's a key to it. This type of mummy bag is... Uh, there, come on. I gotta zip it from the outside. There we go. Okay. And what I do is I get everything all lined up like this, and when I roll over onto my zippered side, what I do is I hold onto the bag so instead of just rolling over and facing the zipper, and I usually have my fleece jacket in here, instead of doing that, the problem is I end up, uh, you know, like smothering myself with a sleeping bag as I wriggle around, roll this bad boy over. That way I've got the biggest port, so even when I've got this completely drawn down where I can see nothing but uh, blackness and breathing, I sleep on the zippered side, and right now on a super thick air mattress, I don't feel this at all. Even on my thinner uh, Z-Rest or anything, I've never felt the zipper with the baffle or anything like that, so that's a huge advantage. The problem is, when you decide to flip to the other side, do you just simply roll over, or you, you actually have to kind of hold on to your sleeping bag and roll and roll and roll and then sleep here because again when it's super freezing and you have this thing shrunk down to a port if you don't do that and you roll away i mean you simply won't be able to breathe or it'll be very unpleasant so yeah my side sleeping technique when i need to flip and flop a lot requires unfortunately a lot of effort and that's just how it is when i'm ultra tired just boom like this but I just simply hold on to the sleeping bag, wriggle over, and it stays with me. Now, the problem is if I have a lot of junk in the sleeping bag, like water bottles or socks to dry or something, let me tell you, it's a drama to flip the sleeping bag back and forth. So ideally, my final conclusion is make yourself a lot more tired. <clears throat> And then you can fall asleep in literally four breaths. I did that in Greenland. I, uh, where is it? Yeah, it's definitely, oops, yeah, I guess not. It's a challenge. I've got my microphone here, so it's a little heavy, but sleeping on the side is definitely a challenge, but if you hold onto your sleeping bag and roll with it, rather than trying to roll inside of it, it's a little bit more effort, but then you don't get the side of the sleeping bag completely covering your face and then, ooh, you can't breathe at all. So that's a, uh, that's a thing, but absolutely not. I don't feel the zipper. It is super, super thin. Now, hopefully you've received your sleeping bag right now. And the interior baffle of this thing is super thick, but even then the zipper is fine. So I never, never have an issue with that. So thank you subscriber, Phil, 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 and any other people watching this video please consider leaving a question that I'll do my best to answer for you. Thank you very much. Please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel.